Before we solve this question, it's important you understand how to find the number of zeros at the end of a factorial. If you don't know that already, then I would recommend you to watch this video on the channel and then come back to this question so that you understand it better. We are given a product where I can write 5 as 5 into 1, 10 as 5 into 2, 15 as 5 into 3 and so on till 5 into 50. Now let's take every two numbers as one set. If you observe every set till 5 into 50, 5 is one number that's coming for 50 times. So we can write 5 as 5 power 50 and the remaining numbers as 1 into 2 into 3 and so on till 50. Now let's keep 5 power 50 as it is but 1 till 50 we can write it as 50 factorial. Now because we need to find the number of zeros, we need to know how many 2s and 5s are there in 50 factorial. Let's first find the number of 2s in 50 factorial. Now 50 when divided by 2 is 25. 25 when divided by 2 is 12. 12 by 2, 6. 6 by 2, 3. 3 by 2, 1. Sum of the quotients is 47. Next, let's find the number of 5s in 50 factorial. 50 when divided by 5 is 10. 10 divided by 5 is 2. Sum of it is 12. Therefore, in 50 factorial, we know the number of 2s are 47 and the number of 5s are 12. And let's keep this 5 power 50 as it is. Therefore, 2s are 47 in number and 5s are 62 in number. And we know the smallest power is the answer. Therefore, there are 47 zeros at the end of this product. 